Another option that I have here, and there are um, reasons why I would take this option, and the uh, first of them is, is I, I personally find it an easier position to attack from, but the disadvantage of this is that I don't have that leg to pivot to uh, get into that uh, uh, switch base position if he tries to sit up on me. So I'm a little bit more vulnerable here, but it's also a little bit easier for me to attack. So I've got this uh, side control position. Maybe I have my leg stretched out, maybe I don't. I don't have room for it right now, so whatever. So from here, right, I'm going to do the same kind of pull up. I'm going to get that same connection over here, and I'm going to pull up on this tricep here. And now instead of uh, just dropping my hips straight down, I'm going to baseball slide it through. And back up a little bit so you can see. Um, when I baseball slide through, this is going to end up under the shoulder. These toes are going to be straight up. So you see, I can't really stop that uh, that sit up there. So I probably, in this position, I want to kind of maintain that my shoulders are in front of my hips, right? So now I've got my hips as the post, not my uh, leg. So from here, I want to have my chest in as far in as I can as I can generally go. Um, my hips are under that shoulder, which is going to start to free up that arm right here. So I can start to slide in and I can start uh, going for attacks from here. Um, so that's going to be kind of, this is called more of a scarf hold. And for me, I think it's a better attack position, but it's a harder position to maintain. And if you're losing this position, this is it right here, right? You see that my shoulders are behind my hips not in front, right? And this is going to be a concept that you're going to see in, uh, in like, guard retention or, uh, or, or surviving in guard or um, if somebody's standing and I'm, I'm doing, like, a Tarzan drill or I'm, I'm going into, like, a sat up uh, De La Hiva, which I don't think I know the name of that position, but it's... Um, I should know that. I should know that. It's been covered at some point in time. But um, De La Hiva is when you are in that position you get knocked over on your back. You can look it up and Google and see what it is. I can't show you right now because I don't have a partner. But um, but yeah, when you get into that kind of setup position, we're going to be here and, and it's going to be, as you can see, pretty close to uh, a technical rise. So um, that's generally going to be um, that concept there is, is having your shoulders in deeper than your hips is what's going to stop you from getting uh, knocked back in that position.